Hello, in this video we're going to talk about the Bluetooth. The Bluetooth client, uh, which have different uh, implementations, and we specifically are going to talk about the NIMBLE, BLE, the Bluetooth Low Energy, and we are going to talk about the NIMBLE libraries for ESP32 inside ESP IDF environment our purpose is to start a client on the ESP32 in ESP IDF environment and scan available service using NIMBLE library in order to uh, define some way the BLE concepts we will refer to GAT at the data management and to GAP as the control connection management. As always, we are starting uh, with the expressive documentation, which in this case, I have a very hard time to understand. It has a very extensive Bluetooth, uh, different Bluetooth derivatives, standard Bluetooth, classic Bluetooth, and so on, including BLE examples, ex ex explanations. And it also mentions the nimble here. And, but for me, it was pretty hard to understand only for this documentation. Also on the net, I found a few examples of nimble from minute like this. And this is example of like uh, 800 uh, lines. And also from expressive, it also uses uh, BLE, and this is an, like an example of 600 lines. So, we are going to our uh, uh, GitHub uh, repository of uh, Sims IoT devices. And our purpose here is to repositories, okay, is to find free Arto's ESP IDF BLE client, the simplest possible. Uh, implementation of uh, this functionality so we have here an MBLE client scan here and this is a file of 80 lines and uh, we will copy this line this uh, code to our editor here but first uh, let's run it just to see how it works and then we will talk more uh, uh, deeply uh, regarding the code and how it was implemented and uh, now what we expect is to find different BLE functionalities different BLE different Bluetooth services and try to understand what we are getting okay here is start scanning okay uh, we have a gap procedure initiated and then we have different Bluetooth discoveries. Here is event discovery. The event was discovered, but uh, the program couldn't understand the name of the service. Uh, on, on the contrary, here we have a TV, Samsung TV discovered and the in this event the name of the event the name of the server was uh, was shown okay let's uh, wait a little bit to see if he can discover something else okay now he also discovered uh, the Xiaomi watch Mi Band 4 which is in this uh, event discovery here he, he managed to find the name of this server okay how this code, code is working you have a different include libraries which are free artos libraries standard expressive libraries and here you have a nimble libraries uh, which we are using uh, you can use other Bluetooth libraries for this functionality according to expressive documentation for different libraries. Uh, we define the tag, define the scan functionality in order to 
simplify it and not using it and then as a header and we will start this program from the end first we have a few lines to initiate initiate the bluetooth server we initiate the memory we initiate the controller here in the second line uh, we initiate the controller stack we define we set the characteristic for this device and initialize the gap connection services then we define the application here this is our application and and also we define the infinite task this is our infinite task you see here which is running so uh, the program now can run an infinite task with defined application the first line inside the application is to uh, find the appropriate address for our client which we will uh, find automatically and then we run the only function functions that we're using the BLE scan function okay the BLE scan function first of all print start scanning here and you can see it here start scanning then we define the uh, the structure which define our con Bluetooth connectivity and a few uh, parameters here are important we don't want to see duplicates here we define that we want to use active scan it is very important you see param passive zero the active scan is very important because it finds better uh, different services and also the standard definition from various uh, examples uh, here uh, the filter window and so on policies and after we define this structure we can use this structure here inside BLE gap disk which is uh, which uh, which defines and connects this structure to the uh, handler okay um, just one moment um, okay inside the handler okay In, inside the handler we have a, a handling of different events and the only event that we are interested in is a nimble event discovery so um, when we have a gap discovery we can parse the, we read the fields that we are discovered and we are interested only only in the name which is discovered so we will print only if the name name length is more than zero so the name of the server of the service was discovered we can print it out so you can see here that in th on those services uh, on those uh, servers the name was discovered on the contrary here the name was discovered and also here the name was discovered and so he was printed out okay now you have seen the basic functionality of the scan the simplest possible way for nim uh, scanning of the bluetooth uh, servers thank you